no, mean deviation about median from the group data. Now, the data is 0 to 10 class interval, 10 to 20, 20 to 30, 30 to 40, 40 to 50, and 50 to 60. Okay. Now, xi, sum of the upper and the lower term divided by 2 or the mid value. 5, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55. Now, if you can see, given 6, 7, 15, 16, 4 and Cumulative frequency 6 as it is 13, 28, 44, 48, 50. Now, first step is to calculate the median. Now, for median. Now, n by 2 is equal to summation for fi upon 2. Now, summation for fi is equal to 50. Okay. So, 50 upon 2 is 25. Now, 25 falls in which class interval? Now, I am just writing here, check, 25 falls, now 25 in the cumulative frequency, okay. 25 from CF falls in which class interval? And again for the formula part, we have to check the introduction. Sorry, check the formula where I have described when group data is there, how to locate the median. Now 25 from 13 to 28, 25 falls where 25 falls in this data. This one. Is it clear? Okay, so now median is equal to L plus N by 2 minus CF upon F into H. Now, CF preceding the class intervals. F this okay so now i am just writing here cf is equal to 13 f is equal to 15 l is equal to 20 l is what l is the lower limit and h is equal to width of the class size that is 10. Now, just substituting the values, we are having 20 plus 50 by 2 minus 13 upon 15 into 10. So, this becomes 20 plus 12 upon 15 into 10. This is equal to 28. Okay. Therefore, Median is 28. Now, completing the table. Now, xi minus median. This one. Okay. So, now, 5 minus 28 in the modular form. So, 23, 13, 3, 7, 17 and 20. Now, fi 
विथ ट्वेंटी थ्री सिक्स विथ ट्वेंटी थ्री वन थर्टी एट थर्टीन टाइम सेवन इज नाइंटी वन फोर्टी फाइव देन सिक्सटीन टाइम सेवन वन वन टू सिक्सटी एट फिफ्टी फोर This is equal to now five. Okay. So mean deviation about median. is equal to 1 upon summation for 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay n is equal to 6 fi times 6 this is equal to 5 Zero eight upon fifty, and is equal to ten point one six. This is the answer. 